While I was out investigating, I found a fascinating new test element. It's never been used for human testing because- Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out the Inquisition Part 1 requested by Demon Arisen. Yes, Demon Arisen requested two map series from Serious Business. And this is the second. So, after the awakening of GLaDOS, you are taken through a testing track involving the Matter Inquisition Field, a yellow fizzler that blocks portal shots and destroys cubes, but doesn't close portals. The puzzles gradually get more difficult as you make your way through six fun-filled chambers, plus two extra bonus chambers. The Inquisition is a map pack that I've been working on for about five to six months. What started as a small experiment with Fourth Reaper's modified fizzler fields turned into one of the biggest projects that I've ever done. It consumed a lot of time and effort. So much time and effort that doesn't go without help. Wait, so much time and effort doesn't go without help, and so I'd like to thank a couple of people. Fourth Reaper, while not directly involved, FR is the reason this map pack exists, and his Matter Inquisition Field is the entire focus. Jose Pez DJ is responsible for the glowing button bases, as well as the rest of the signage, both minor details adding up to big difference. LP Freaky 90's contribution was the Death Fizzler seen in one of the bonus maps, as well as some modeling. Keep an eye out for a spanner. Tile Tile created broken fan models, which were very valuable in the destroyed sections. And of course, I'd like to thank those who playtested for me. LP Freaky 90, Team S98, Mevius, Wild Goose Speeder, Yishbar. And finally, I'd like to thank the Portal 2 community. The formalities are out of the way, enjoy the maps. Right, I'm going to stop recording, and then start recording, and hopefully OBS does not screw up my audio. Be right back. That was scary, it took a really long time to stop recording. Well, hopefully the audio is not too messed up. Contact with it causes heart failure. The literature doesn't mention anything about lump of coal failure, though, so you should be fine. Oh, GLaDOS. I'm no lump of coal. I can't be sometimes, I guess. Well, isn't that fancy? What is even happening right now? So yeah, I guess these are what eventually ended up in B-Mod. They look slightly different. The ones in B-Mod definitely look better. But yeah, this is one of the first tests I used them, I guess. What does this do for us? Response to cube, I guess. <laughs> Why did I do that, though? Um, Can't I just do this? I guess so. What all's up there? Nothing? Nothing of interest? Alright. Was that what I was supposed to do? That didn't quite feel right, but... Okay, there's also, like, random portal surfaces here. Sure. I mean, I guess it's fine to have random portal surfaces. Oh. Uh, okay. Alright, on to the next one. That is scary, it's very dark here. What the? I thought I felt like I... I felt like I ran into some invisible collision here, but I can't find it now. Mono portal puzzles are fun. So, what the heck is up with that laser? That's interesting. Huh. Yeah, very interesting. So, let's get started, shall we? There we go. We can walk over and press this button. Hello! Safety net. <laughs> That's funny. If I had to guess, I would say those would also extend momentarily. Maybe. I guess we'll find out. So let's look over and get this cube. It had... when it landed, had a way to stop it from falling off the light bridge, which is very much appreciated. I wish more hammer mappers would do that. Yes! Ta-da! I told you guys. That's exactly what that's for. Alright, and then we can just get to the exit. That might actually be the end of both of these. Why does this look weird? Anyway. <laughs> oh, silly me. Uh There we go. Sorry about the mess. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, thanks for that. Alright, basic enough introduction. Basically the pre the first area was teaching us that it fizzles cubes, and then this area was teaching us that it doesn't clear portals, but we still can't shoot through it. Right. So, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!